So we are going to discuss about uh, the blanks and uh, multiple choice of uh, the textual in the textbook, open air textbook. Uh, there you can see that some blanks and uh, choose multiple choice are given. We are going to answer it. See there, fill in the blanks. The first one, longer line in the symbol for a cell represents dash terminal. Longer line, first one is longer line, okay, of a symbol for a cell, okay. Represents uh, what it will represent? It will represent positive terminal. Okay, next uh, smaller line in the symbol for a cell represents a uh, dash terminal. Second one, small line. It represents a uh, negative terminal. Okay, the first one represents a uh, positive terminal, the second one represents negative terminal. Third one, combination of two or more cells is called a uh, battery. Okay. The combination of two or more cells is called battery. Fourth one is uh, the safety device used in electricity, electric current is the safety device used in electric current is uh, fuse. Did you understand? What is the safety device? Fuse. Next one. The device used to close and open a circuit is called uh, the device used to close and open the device is called a uh, switch. What is that? The device used to open and close uh, the circuit is called a switch. Next one, uh, here two or false are given. Try to answer them. In series connection, electricity has only one path. Is it true or false? So the first one is uh, true. Already I told for you. So in series connection, a single path will be present. Okay. The next one, in parallel circuit, uh, electricity has more than one path. Is it true or not? Yes, it is true. It is having more than one part. Third one, to make a battery of two cells, negative terminal of one is connected to negative terminal of the other. Will it happen? Negative should be connected to positive. Positive, positive should be connected to negative. So what he gave the third one is false. Okay, the third one is false. Fourth one is when the uh, electric current, uh, okay, the when the electric current uh, through the pass through the fuse uh, exceeds a certain limit, fuse wire melts and breaks the circuit. At high voltage, what will happen to the fuse? The wire will melt and it break up. Is it true or false? Yes, it is uh, true. Okay, the first one, second one true, the third one false, fourth one true. Fifth one, switch is uh, used to close and open a circuit. Just now we did here blind. So what is that? It is uh, true. Got the point? Now again multiple choice question was there. Arun buys uh, 4 bulbs. Listen carefully. 15 watts, 40 watts, 60 watts, 100 watts. What are the 4 bulbs he is having? 15, 40, 60, 100. Which can be used as night bulb? Which one we will use as night bulb? The bulb which is of... Uh, 15 watts we will use it as night bulb. Why? Because at that particular time we are sleeping. At night we don't want a bright light. The light must be very less. So which one we will use? We will use 15 watts bulb. Next, device used to, again the same thing was repeated. Next, which one device used to open and close the circuit is? Switch. Okay, third one. Which one of the following is used as a light source? Cassette player, electric mixer, Rice cooker, table lamp. Which one we will use as a light source? It is a table lamp. Which one we are using? Table lamp we are using. Why I wrote here three you understood? The second one is switch automatically you know. Then safety device used in electric circuit is already we answered here. What is that? It is fuse. Fuse is used as a safety device device okay that is of your textual questions here mass the following was there let us do that one. this one was completed now we are going with match the following okay first one cell second one switch Third one, 
circuit. Fourth one, miniature circuit breaker. Sorry, breaker. Next, fifth one, fuse. Then, here one, two, three, four, five. Coming to here, A, B, C, D, E. Now, what is A? To open and close a circuit. Okay, second one. Safety device. Safety device used in the circuit. Safety device used in the circuit. Third one. Complete path for flow of current. Fifth one is reset by hand. Then a device converts chemical energy chemical energy into electric energy chemical energy into electrical energy now see here cell what is a cell a device converts chemical energy into electrical energy what is a switch to open and close a circuit okay then what is a circuit what is a circuit complete path of flow of a current okay what is miniature circuit breaker? Reset by hand. Then what is a fuse? Where it is given? Fuse safety device used in the circuit. Okay. Safety device used in the circuit. So please check your answers. Cell. A device converts chemical energy into electrical energy. Switch. It is used for water to open and close the circuit. Then circuit, it is used to, uh, for what purpose, uh, complete path of a flow of a current. Miniature circuit breaker to reset by hand. And fuse safety device used in the circuit. So let us go for the next one. Oh, good so the next one is, uh, what are... What are fluorescent lamps? Let us talk about. Already yesterday I told for you. Normal lamps means they consume more electricity. Here we are going with the compact fluorescent lamps. Now CFL. What is the use of this CFL? We are going to discuss about this one. Fluorescent lamp. So, answer for this one is they don't have
So please see here. What are fluorescent lamps means? They do not have metal filaments. Okay. When electric current passes through certain gases like argon. Okay. This point you have to know. When electric current passes through certain gases like we know that helium, neon, krypton, argon. So gases like argon they emit light. Okay. Then this property is called fluorescence. What we will say that property as fluorescence. The gas filled lamps. Which gas was filled here? Argon gas. Okay. Which gas was filled in uh, tube lights or fluorescent light? Argon gas was filled. Okay. The gas filled lamps like uh, tube lights, fluorescent bulbs, etc. are examples. What is fluorescent lamp? Which gas was filled in that particular one? They do not have metal filaments. When electric current passes through certain gases like argon, they emit light. This property is called fluorescence. And the gas filled lamps like tube lights, fluorescent bulbs, etc. are examples. Okay, next one. What is a fuse we are going to see, which is very, very important. Coming to the next point, what is a fuse? So see here, what is a fuse? A small piece of wire made of low melting alloy inserted in the circuit. That is what is that alloy? It is a copper. Okay, low melting alloy inserted in the circuit is called a fuse. When there is a sudden increase in the current flow, which is called short circuit, the fuse wire melts and breaks the circuit. Did you understand? See here, a small piece of wire made of a low melting alloy inserted in the circuit is called fuse. When there is a sudden increase in the current flow, which is called short circuit, the fuse wire melts and breaks the circuit. Got the point? These are for today. Thank you.